What's up, guys? It's Thorn Maker, and now you're watching NBA 2K TV. This week on 2K TV, Bucks big man Thorn Maker. I really enjoy playing online. Sometimes you interact with fans. Winning tips. For you bigs out there, I've got five tips for you to take your game to the next level. A look at the 2K TV My Team collection. And your first opportunity to earn one of these cards is right now. The latest in My Team. We have Pink Diamond Kristaps Porzingis. And your top plays of the month. Hey guys, I'm Rachel and welcome to this week's episode of NBA 2K TV. The Milwaukee Bucks Thon Maker has been making his mark this season with the team and he's also been breaking some personal records in the past few months. We had a chance to catch up with him while he was on the road. So it is your second season in the NBA and of course, second season in NBA 2K. What was it like seeing yourself in the game for the first time? It was really exciting. So when you play NBA 2K, what mode do you jump into? I really enjoy playing online. Sometimes you interact with fans and then um, to actually just see the themes and go through the game and, and try to live it out. It's fun too. On your My Team card, one of the strengths that you have is outside shooting. How important do you think outside shooting is to your game? It's very important because, you know, the league is transitioning towards mobile basketball. So a lot of guys are working on their craft, especially the outside shooting, bigs in particular. So you are one of the only players in recent years to go essentially straight from high school to the NBA. What went through your mind when you realized that you were entering into the draft and your pro dreams were, were coming true? As a kid, you dream of you know, just playing in the NBA, you watch a lot of NBA basketball, and then when I heard my name called in the draft, you know, I couldn't believe it, you know? Luckily, you didn't have to wait too long at the draft. Nah, that, that part of, that's, too. That's pretty crazy, that's pretty yeah. cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool, a lot of people thought it was a stretch, but as soon as they saw what I did, when I got my opportunity, they're like, okay, you know, the kid you know, does belong. So you have a younger brother who is also following in your footsteps. You know, he recently just declared for the draft and uh, very happy for him, excited for him as well. Well, we will have to look out for him. You have played sports yeah. all around the world in different countries. So do you feel like you've gotten some advantages from playing in so many so many different styles. Uh, you you actually get better because for me, I experience the international basketball, the international style of play is um, more focused on ball movement, making the right play. Whereas in the US, uh, there's a lot of focus on explosion and um, you know, like the dunks and the highlights of crossovers and uh, individual play. So you kind of incorporate both. The season is coming to a close. Are you looking forward to working on anything in your personal game during off season? You know, you, you can never get satisfied in the NBA. You can't think you're too good, so you can't really relax. And uh, I, I just need to work on my overall game, you know, uh, as, as a player and come back better. Well, good luck for the end of the season. Thank you for coming on 2K TV. Thank you. I oh, enjoyed it. Bye-bye. All right. <laughs> What's going on 2K fans, it's Scott O'Gallagher here and we're back for some more winning tips and we're talking all about the big man. So for you bigs out there, I've got five tips for you to take your game to the next level. The first thing you need to do as a big man is you gotta make sure that you control the glass. One of the biggest mistakes I see out there from bigs is that they look for the ball first instead of finding their man. A good rule of thumb is to make sure you hit and sit before you find the basketball. The second thing I have for you is that you gotta get easy baskets. One of the easiest ways to do this as a big is to make sure that after every missed shot, you are making a direct line and sprinting to the front of the rim. Another big thing that you can do when it comes to sprinting is make sure that you are sprinting to your screen. The later that the hedge man comes, the harder it is for him to get out to the ball carrier, which then leaves you open to the basket. The third thing is don't try to block every shot. 
You look around the NBA and most shot blocking opportunities come from the weak side. Sometimes the best play is just getting in front of the shooter with your hands up. The fourth thing is of course our IQ. How do we improve our IQ as post players? One of the rules of thumb is called no post to post. Basically, if there is a post there on the strong side and you're on the weak side, you need to leave that spot immediately and go right to the high post. From there, there's all other types of options. You can play a high-low game, you can catch and shoot at 15 feet, or you can simply swing the ball to the weak side for a side screen and roll. Those three things will immediately help your effectiveness out on the pro end. The last thing, when you catch the ball on the block, I see a lot of guys out there, as soon as they catch it, they're eager to make a move. Catch it, let things develop, and then do what you know how to do best, and that's get buckets. So there you have it. There's five tips that you can use on the real hardwood or an NBA 2K18. You just join us for a couple minutes, and now you are a better player, because that's what we do. Winners win, and I'm out. Here's a look at the players that hit 98 overall this week. your 2K TV My Team cards. That's right guys, we have our own collection. Over the coming weeks, we will be releasing cards featuring guests that have been on 2K TV this season, including this week's guest, Thon Maker. We also have Glenn Robinson III, Marquise Chris, Greg Anthony, and Kenny the Jet Smith. They are only available here on 2K TV through 2K TV Interactive. So look out for those questions that include these players, answer them correctly, and you will earn their card. Get all five and you'll receive an Amethyst Tobias Harris, our first guest on this season. And your first opportunity to earn one of these cards is right now. Thon Maker is our first pick for the 2K TV My Team collection, and the Bucks selected Thon with which pick in the 2016 draft? Was it the second pick, the 10th pick, the 20th pick, or the 60th pick? As a kid, you dream of you know, just playing in the NBA. You watch a lot of NBA basketball. And then when I heard my name called in the draft, you know, I couldn't believe it, you know? Luckily, you didn't have to wait too long at the draft. Nah, that, that <laughs> part that's, too. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, guys. If you got that question correct, then enjoy taking the court with Thon. And for more on My Team Collections, here's Robbie. Thanks, Rachel. I hope you guys got that Thon Maker card. That's a great way to get into My Team, and it's a really nice way to get some good players right away as well. Quick note on the Sapphire Thon Maker card. This is one of those low key budget cards that you're gonna enjoy using no matter if it's online or offline. The guy has size, he has three point shooting ability, and he'll be able to grab some rebounds as well. His speed is really a very important asset, very good underrated card to have on your front line. Speaking of collections, you can earn a lot of great players from completing them. Pink Diamond Kevin Garnett's available right now for the KG Teammates collection, and past players include guys like Chris Paul, Chris Webber, future Hall of Famers, and outstanding guys to have on your squad. Speaking of the KG Teammates collection, I wanted to throw the spotlight on a few players. Diamond. Carl Anthony Towns is an amazing shooter, all around player, and he's going for a lot of MT already on the auction house. If you're lucky enough to pull that card or get that card, he is gonna be immediate starting center candidate for any team. One of the best cards in the game right now. Also, if you need a scoring punch and an outside shooting card, Paul Pierce is that dude. He'll get to the line and he's very efficient. Learn to use this card and you'll have a lot of success. And I can't forget the GOAT, Brian Scalabrini is in this set. It's a Ruby card, it's an 87 overall, but we don't care about any of that right now. The important thing to know is he is actually very good in the game. 
He can run a pick and roll for you. He can run a pick and fade for you. And he's got that wet jump shot. Don't overlook the GOAT. People will throw away this Scalabrini card. Pick him up, give him a home, put him on your team, and you won't regret it. Moving from one GOAT to another, we have Pink Diamond Kristaps Porzingis. Now available as the season reward in Supermax in my team. Very exciting to see the reactions from everybody about this card, and I can't wait to play Supermax either. It's gonna be great. Make sure that you get to that Pink Diamond tier in every round, and then Pink Diamond Kristaps Porzingis will be yours. So get out there, collect all the goats, and remember, you can't beat my team. It's the 2K MC. Each week you choose your favorite play, and now it's time for you to choose the top play of the month. 250,000 VC is at stake. Now let's go, 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 go! <laughs> yeah, you guys remember this one. Good old George with the free throw duck over people. Staying in Pro-Am with DK Bully. Throwing down the vicious duck. And then the disrespect. I really don't think that man had any choice but to rage quit. Oh, yeah. Next up is Kuda Ant with the double ankle breaker from Heck. Yeah, I said Heck. Then capping it off with the nasty dunk. And now we got Air Zeus cleaning up his teammate's mistake and dunking over him. Woo! Get out of the way. Vote now for your top play of the month, where the winner gets 250,000 VC. And submit your plays on social media with the hashtag 2KTVWOW. It's 2KMC. Maybe we're both signing off this time. That's all we've got for this week, guys. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.